Hello there, my Lynn and Things family and friends. Yes, y'all, your girl Lynn here is here with another video, another friend mail, guys. This friend mail came from another one of my loyal subbies, um, Taco Patty. Hey, Taco Patty, I got the package today. Um, and y'all, I have to share, so it's going to be kind of like some taste testing because she sent me some goodies, y'all, goodies that I can eat. So one of the goodies that came in this big box of stuff, y'all, was, um, let me see if I can grab one out. Yeah. It is a, a lemon honey ginger tea, y'all. Oh, you know what? That says ginseng. I thought that said ginger. But I love honey and lemon, so this was a great mix. And it is a green tea, it says. So, y'all, I went on ahead and used my green tea mug to make a mug of it and it is good y'all mm, mm, mm. it's nice and it's subtle so y'all settle on in for this fun taste test friend meal but right before i get into i'm gonna set that to the side right before we get into the video y'all i had to make a stop at dollar tree y'all for the grand pup because the puppy came back and um, he's still sitting here next to me sleeping. But I wanted to go grab a couple things for him at the Dollar Tree. What do I see? Not looking for it. I'm going straight to the dog aisle, y'all. I finally see the Nomi towel. <gasps> oh my gosh. And this is one of my least favorite Dollar Trees. It is weird how some of my, the least that I go to, when I go, they tend to have some of the things I've been looking for. I've been looking for this thing for probably a month. Um, I really, really want the coffee cup, that to-go cup. They had the pot holders where, and they had the, the hand um, pot holders. So, you know, the, the glove, and then they have just the, the square pot holders. But I grabbed the towel because I just, I have really, really, really been wanting this. I don't even know why. I just think it's so cute. I should have grabbed a couple more because it's just been so hard to find this thing. And then, what else did I find? <sighs> yes, y'all. The Hey There Pumpkin Rug. So, I, I did grab a couple of those, y'all. Do you know how long I have been looking for this rug? And it just popped up on me today by surprise, y'all. I'm just getting blessed all over the place. I, I really, really am. So, a little bit, uh, one more thing to show. My artist daughter, who loves to paint, got the painting again, y'all. And I wanted to show one, because she knows I've been looking for the gnome towel. And I was talking about it one of these days, and she, look what she painted, y'all. She went and painted me a gnome. Isn't he cute holding his pumpkin? Oh my gosh, I love, love, love when she just wants to paint the, I just love the artistic, you know, side of my daughter. I thought that was so, so cute because I couldn't find the Nomi towel. And now I have found the towel. Yay. And she made me a brown Nomi. Okay. But not only did she paint that, look at this cutie here. It's Snoopy. Yes, y'all. It's a Halloween Snoopy peeking down into the pumpkin. Y'all, I don't know. We're going to have to start a whole new gallery wall around here, y'all. <laughs> because they are really, really adding up. So now we're going to get into this great and nice a treat box. It is a treat box. And look, y'all, just to start off. Now, I'm affectionately called City Girl because Taco Patty is not that far from me in Illinois. and But it's more like country where she is. So I call her Country Girl. She calls me City Girl. So that's why this says City Girl. But look at this, y'all. Isn't that so cute? I absolutely loved the card. And then, like I say, you guys, y'all just pay attention so well. It's just amazing. The detail on this Halloween card, y'all. Now, y'all know I love me some pumpkin spice. And when I saw that, I was like, look at the little, looking like almost pumpkin spice drinks on there. So it says tricks and treats, fun and friends. But I love this. It says trick or treat, you're so sweet, sent you something good to eat. I thought that was so, so cool. I absolutely love that. Patty, you really, really outdid yourself with this card. And then it's got the cute little stickers. It's got the little candy sticker. Look at that. 
yes the thoughtfulness behind this is just heartwarming i love it love 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 when people can be just thoughtful and then she went so far as to wrap everything yeah i have opened it up but i tried not to open it so much that i could not show you guys this awesomeness that she way that she wrapped everything so look at this y'all how cute is that she wrapped everything up and so i opened up just the top just to see what was in here and look what's in here y'all you remember i was on the hunt for these things and she put three boxes in there so I don't have to taste this because I know what these taste like. They're yummy. So I won't be opening that up. But I am going to taste some things in this box, y'all. Um, this next thing. Um, let's see. I kind of messed up how this one was wrapped. I want to show you, though. Look at this. So this is the outside of this one. You see the doggy and the cat. Love, love, love these stickers. So I, I did open this up. I'm going to sit that to the side. And look what it is guys it is pumpkin spice flavored pretzels so we are going to give this a try yes we are let's see y'all how does the pumpkin spice pretzels taste mmm I like mmm these are good these are good. So they're pumpkin spice yogurt flavored pretzels. I taste the pumpkin. It's not overly pumpkin-y. <laughs> I like that. And we're going to get a little sip of our tea. Yum-o. Okay, guys. And look at this. I thought that was absolutely adorable. No, I love me some done, right? So this is written in done font. And then so is the little sticker on the back that says for you. And inside of here, it's just some more goodies. So like, I feel like when they do the boo to you thing where they, you know, put like a little Halloween, you know, basket or something on your porch, you know, just to say, hey, neighbor or something. That's what this made me feel like. Like I got booed, <laughs> you know, that was so, so cute. So I like that my next thing in here look at this y'all look at the little ghost and the black cat in the booth so inside of here i opened it up and it is a package of a multi-flavored cookies and it says that it is made with greek style yogurt so there is a blueberry yogurt a strawberry yogurt a peach yogurt now peach is different and a vanilla um I don't know which one I want to try. Um, well, I love blueberries, so I'm going to try a blueberry and maybe one of the peach. But let's see. So this is how they come. And it feels like four cookies are inside. So we're going to taste one. We're going to say, hey, I got blue on. Funny, I picked the blueberry. I love lemon and blueberry together, y'all. I really do. So yummy. So I'm just going to break off half of a cookie here. And it's blue, y'all, for blueberry. Whoa. And it smells like blueberry. What? Like, that blueberry smell just hits you. Okay. Mmm. I like that, too. Thank you, Patty. Mmm. And, guys, this lemon tea... Ooh, tea and cookies go together. Mmm, that cookie is good. And just because, I'm going to try the peach. So I know that that blueberry has a nice flavor to it. I like how the peach, it looks yellow though. I almost thought that was lemon. But it says peach, so we're going to try a little piece of peach. Now, this does not smell overly peachy. I smell, I do smell it though. I do smell it. We're going to break a little piece of that. And that was funny because it looks, well, my light it won't, it's not doing it justice, but it looks like yellow. It's 
So, mm, because it's peach, but I, I don't detect a lot of peach. The blueberry tastes blueberry. The peach, oddly enough, is making me think of vanilla. I don't know. It's not, it's not very peachy, but I mean, it's good, but it tastes more like a vanilla to me. Um, matter of fact, while I'm saying vanilla, let me see. I'm going to try one of the vanilla, just a little bite of one of the vanilla. It's a lot of cookies, y'all. I'm going to need a big ton of water after this, a big ton of water. It's something so classic about vanilla. I love vanilla. And this this is good. Nice, mild vanilla. That's good. But it's funny that the peach is mm, kind of like a vanilla to me. Mm. Watch that down. Okay, guys, this is so fun. Okay, next look at this guy with the candy corn. The ghost with the candy corn look like it's a hat on him. I try not to open it all the way. And she, look, she even wrapped it. I had it was wrapped like this with another green bow. So so cute. I love how you took your time with this, Patty. This was so very very thoughtful and creative. Thank you. Like I feel like I got to get more creative with my. <laughs> gifts that I send out because this was just oh my goodness so cute okay guys ooh this is Benton's pumpkin spice cookie wafers now I had brought me some scissors because I was like I'm pretty sure that this is going to be hard to open oh actually it's not oh okay look at that see I brought the scissors because I thought I was going to need them, but this tape that they have on here, it's like not overly sticky, but it's sticky. Oh, I love that. Did Dollar Tree have these? I if if, if Dollar Tree had them, my Dollar Tree didn't. I did not see this, these in Dollar Tree, but um, it looks like she went to different places to get certain things, so this might not be a Dollar Tree item. Cause I I would have saw that. I, I would have spotted that. Or, if it is, my Dollar Tree hasn't gotten it yet. <gasps> it smells so good, y'all. It even, it, it's, it's like, I smell cinnamon. I smell clove. Hmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Yeah. That's so good. I love wafers and things like this with a cup of coffee. Well, we got tea today. Yeah, y'all. I like this. Mm hmm But I love wafers. I love a light cookie. And this is good. Now, the inside I'm tasting now is pretty sweet. I'm glad that they have the wafer and the wafer is lightly sweet. So it mixes together pretty well. But great pumpkin spice flavor. Great. All right, take another bite. <laughs> okay, guys, we're gonna sit that there. And then oh, we have this a uh, big box here. Look at that. It says Happy Halloween. I mean, I I love that you took your time to wrap each and every package. I love, love, love that. And then in here. These are lemon cookies, y'all. So I opened it up. This is big. So there are six packs of six. No, I love me some lemon, y'all. So I definitely, definitely have to try one of these a lemon cookies. And it says by Emper Emperado. Emperado. Okay. Lemon flavored sandwich cookies. We got to see what that's all about, y'all. Gotta, gotta see what this one is about. Ooh. The lemon scent bursts right out of the bag. 
good sign and look at that cookie it looks like there's some sugar on the outside of the cookie it's nice and toasty so yeah there is something on the outside of this cookie both sides it looks like a glaze or like they put sugar and then they kind of baked it and it kind of glazed over the top I'm usually not a fan of things with the sugar on top though I really aren't I don't know why but we're gonna give this a try mmm hmm guys now I like this because this doesn't taste like a cookie um this is a cracker so it's a biscuit cracker type i like that and then the only thing making it sweet is the lemon on the inside this is good mm -hmm. mm. yeah mm, mm, mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. still chewing sorry <laughs> i like this um patty this is a nice that's a big box this is a nice find that's something i would snack on like when i want a little i'm not gonna say midnight snack because i don't snack that late but in the evening when i'm getting ready to i want something to snack on and i might make a cup of coffee or you know tea or something like that that's great because it is more of a cracker but it has lemon in it i love that Thank you, thank you, thank you for such a fun video, Patty. I got the goodies, and they are good. Thank you so much for packing that so beautifully. That is just, like I said, it just touches my heart how thoughtful you guys are when you, you know, think to want to send me anything, you know, and then you guys send me some of my favorite things. I love this because this was some things that I've never had before. Oh, and I, did I show you guys the tea? Like, I've never seen this tea before. So it says a uh, private selection, but it's quite yummy. Um, I, like I said, I do love honey. I do love lemon. I love tea. Um, I'm a big chai tea drinker, but I do, uh, I do like that. That's really good as well. And then it's lemon y'all. Y'all know I love me some lemon, but as I was saying, this was a fun video to do to just kind of try some things that I haven't, you know, tried before. Thank you for, you know, finding some different things for me, Patty. That is really, really awesome of you and all of my subbies hey thank you so much for stopping in again spending a few minutes with me if you aren't a subbie why not go ahead and hit that subscribe button and when you hit that subscribe button make sure to hit the little drop down and hit the all so that every time i upload you will know yes ma'am i would love love to have you at the land in the landing things family you guys are amazing um please please don't forget hit that like that like really does help our channel and it does help to let youtube know to spread this video and make it you know a little bit easier for other people to find me as well so just like you guys love me maybe we can find some more love out there <laughs> thank you guys so much i hope you enjoy the rest of your evening